but we can do it by ourselves. <clears throat> Conquest of Patan. No idea where his friend is over there, Kandesh. All right. Presumably, yeah, they're doing that already. <clears throat> Let's just go stand in Patan. And getting some sailors. We've got pretty decent cash. Alright, what are we on? Still 13.8. It's a 12. Which should be okay. And what are we doing over here? We need 25 for the next one. Okay. <clears throat> Gujarat holding Patan, yeah. Rather multicolored down there at the moment. Oh, I forgot Bamanas were in that too. And Mawat. Alright, let's get started on Tata first. In 52. Alright, Mansoor, come home. They got nobody on the capital. Guess we'll go get started down there. Then Umakot should be next month. We're actually getting 8, 8, 10. It's not bad. Alright, do they have an army? No. So, no, we'll stay there. Don't want to mess with uh, splitting it up. Kandesh gives uh, Burrampur and Darangaon to Malwa. Okay. Those two. Well, I guess we don't really care about that stuff yet. Uh, taking Sarat. Actually, we're blocking them from taking land because they don't own any of the forts in the area. That's funny. So it is the Malwani Conquest of Baroda. So he's going to have ticking war score. But is he allowed to take anything? Alright, let's go fabricate our claim on Kutch. You don't really need to send the other guy out. Um, Nagore we weren't going to do. We could go... Up to Mawat. He's allied with Jean Poor. Alright. Gualia. Gunarg. Started fabricating that way. And didn't actually check out this other one in the end. Stability 2 owns her doti and wouldn't be. Can't you click on her there? Ah, oh, okay. So we just gotta integrate them. Mutiny of the Rathoras and Malwa have made it abundantly clear we need to bring greater order amongst our retainers. We must not rest until all our lands are in good hands. Okay. And that'll give us these two. Yeah. It's not actually all that many missions. Okay. Money's not looking great. <laughs> Inflation's looking horrible as expected. And that's what we should send the other guy to do. Go and improve relations with the Rana Biru Haru Chauham. I have taken Amadabad. So, presumably, still no army anywhere. Um, we're at war with Kandash. Let's just go head over there. Peace out, there's uh, nothing else I can do. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
Kelly is declared on Mawat. Mawat. Mawat's the little one. Okay. Dealing with Hindu zealots. Visit from some shady people. Spun out construction. That we just take straight out prestige. And there's our diplomacy. Indian Archivistia. Or shock. Okay. Our armies are exiled. I'll deal with that in a sec. Gujarat seeds Baroda, Sarat, and Baruk. Oh, and they rather blob out a little. Um guess we can just jump in there and take everything else down to here. Got Putan. Hang on, C. Yeah. Didn't notice he had one Sage Poop. Would we want to vassalize them? Could be a good idea to get these back off uh, Malwa if we end up going to war with them. Kutch, we're not getting married, buddy. Alright. We don't mind that fabricating on Khala. He's over from Gujarat. Uh, yeah, fair enough. Let's just finish this off. Get their money at least. We're looking at three out of four. And her dodi won't be around forever, so. And these guys, uh, they do have a bad opinion of us. Hostile relations. Here comes the Renaissance. Alright, Jane Moneylender, there's a call in debts. Well, what do we need the most? We need the Janes. We don't particularly care about the Janes, they don't give us anything hugely useful. Development costs down if you build temples. Hmm. Alright, maybe do that. Gain base tax and get local development costs. Seems reasonable. Otherwise, Vaishyas. Production efficiency and advisor costs. That could actually be useful. Or lose a stack of money. Let's go to production efficiency loss, which is a bit of our money. How much do we care about the Jains? Not enough. Goodbye, Jainists. All right, we can make a state of Southern Sindh. That seems perfectly reasonable. Um, the points, I guess we'd benefit. From Bharat, you know, the Rajputs, etc., etc. Oh, God. 0.02, it's not that bad. Like this 0.11 per year. Partner is going to attack somebody. We can convert provinces. No, we can't. Ah, there goes Talna. So, first things first. He is a wrong religion. But the province is Hindu. So we can just force him to switch. Uh, let's have a look how much money we can get instead. Bugger all. Alright, he's going to become our vassal. No real problems anywhere. Um, give us the cash as well. Alright. And then... He's not too bad, but he's about to be. Their opinion must be positive towards religion. Fair enough. Right, over here in Gwalia, let's do Gird. Bring him home. Oh, of course, that means we can't get out of there. Maybe we can wander around that way. Alright, let's just go. Sufi Peace, take Patan, Marabad, and Kambot. Gujarat, Sindh, Mawa, Nagore, Malta. I really do want all of that stuff though. 
do it this way. It's only 36. It's somewhat safer. Molten's the bottom of that list. Otherwise, just adds in Baluchistan. You know what? Don't mind spending a little Diplo for a while. Let's make him a vassal. And 0.17 inflation. Yeah, screw it. Not going to break any cores. Um, I guess we could take Patan. Lucistan was now March. All right, let's just give up on that. Could be a little dangerous. Oh, we're in another war. Didn't even bother to look for that. We're winning the war against Palatana, who are little guys down here. We can call in Jumpur. I mean, we're sure as hell not going to be doing anything for it. And because we're at war, can we? Nope, can't skip out. Jean Paul might get access for us, though. Alright, and. That one, this one, that one, that one, no, that one. Subject countries. High liberty desire. Yeah, you could say that. I guess we're just going down there. At least we'll be able to get Black Flag down here. There we go. And get you in Moa. Alright, money's looking good. Let's repay the loan while I'm thinking about it. So, if we find ourselves a war with Moa. We have, was it Bengal as their ally? Then at least we'll be able to force them to give stuff back to both of those vassals down there. Hadodi has no claims except on us. This war is just going to be an absolute slaughter that we don't have to worry about. Other than his army being over there. Jean-Paul doing at the moment. Alright, goes the siege. Let's go up and kill their men. Bring war exhaustion down soon. He's coming over here, is he? Oh, let's get our army back together. We do take this, we'll wait until there's a call for peace because we'll put us over. Um, probably want to take it for ourselves. Just start looking at where everything is. Take everything in the Gujarat node first would be fantastic. Which means Jangladesh, Jai Solma, Sind, Kutch, good guys down there. Gujarat node goes way down to Vijanagar. Speaking of which, um, 63. Let's try to deal with them. They hate Bamanis, we hate Bamanis. Nasapur is back. And he is over there. Alright, caught him. Killed him. I think we can get away with not paying the army. Pretty sure there's no. No. Let's uh, mothball all forts. We'll pick up another. No, just our original two. Alright, we'll sit around for a bit. Palatana one out. Uh, we'll have a look in December or January. That's the uh, actual progress. Uh, 
else we're even doing? Janigar, Hadodi, and Home Subjects. In a war together needs to go away. Hmm. Alright. So this is the bit where we sit around. We can see China, of course. Issue our body suspects neighbours. Sin's opinion down or Kutch's opinion down. Actually care about Kutch to the point that we want to drop them because we're actually one over the limit. Cindy Separatists. Yeah, they're going to happen no matter what. Let's go to stand in pub. And first military again. Indian Archivists. Cavalry or. Yeah, screw it. Elephant archers, just because. Glorious armies under attack. And they just squeezed that one out. Army's even cheaper now. The only problem really is that the war exhaustion can't come down, but at least it's not going up any higher. Stability. Religious unity is going to be a problem. Guess get started on Umakot. Since they've just had their recent uprising, there's going to be no problem finishing that on time. There's our call for peace. Alright, we can afford to wait until December. Question will become, can we take it for ourselves? Because I would definitely prefer that. Or do we have to feed it to Gujarat? I think that would cost the same anyway, wouldn't it? We need to get this up to 225, actually 215. What is that war? Galean conquest of Mawat. <laughs> He's losing to Mawat. Good. Probably be the perfect time to go to war with Delhi. Luke Stan, Bengal, and Sindh. Um, go to war with Delhi to take. Bangladesh and Chulru. But aggressive expansion problems. Access from Kangara. Bengal has arrived with us. Way the hell over there, but okay. They usually fall apart. What's the deal with Mahikanta? It's with Baglana. God. Champur accepted peace with Delhi. Alright. He was getting pretty overrun there. It's like his army was busy doing something else. <laughs> and we've got to do this in December. 0.1 per month. Well, let's bring. Let's go back from Vijayanagar. Alright. We'll have that. Let's just get the royal marriage now. Inflation for Diplo, yes. So, how are we looking? If we take Govilvard, Kutch have a problem. Screw them. Don't know how they think they did that much. Alright, it's only worth eight molten. I mean, we can play it safe. You know what? Let's play it safe. Wait till December. War exhaustion. Meh. Delhi seeds Bariana to Mawat, Lahore and Batnea to Multan. Okay. Problem is, they're now at peace. No, did he also release them? <laughs> Alright. I mean, I've got to take advantage, right? Especially when he has zero army. Alright, 
right, so they go through to Truru. And the siege leader goes over there. Our war exhaustion is high, yes. That's only August. That's going to get worse because we want to take that land. Hmm. You know, we actually want to do that. Um, let's go try and get Araya to die. Bring these guys down to Mawa because we don't want to take his capital. Trying to avoid the call for peace on that for as long as we can. Yeah, that's the plan so far. It is November. Dunda declared on Mawat. Mawat. Mawat's the little one. He just expanded. Alright. It has turned December. So, just wait until about halfway through the month. You know, we'll give them a Christmas present. A day late. <clears throat> Nothing else we can do. Send that. Thank you for your land. And we're actually going to be able to do idea groups pretty soon. Just really want this guy to die so we can get a decent leader. How long? Four years. So we're going to drag this war out indefinitely. Access from Jasoma. Yeah, go for it. And then, I mean, eventually, we want to take both of these. That's only another eight. Molten, Malwa, Raw. Probably want to do this at the end of the year then. Gore and Sind. Aggressive expansion coming down 2.5 per year. Yeah. I mean, the only rush is to get war exhaustion to start going away. Hmm. The other thing was, I did want to change this. <clears throat> right, six out of four. I really need to drop Kutch. Let's just dissolve this alliance now. It's completely useless to us. And that's right, because we just went for Janagar. Alright. Well, while we're sitting around not doing much, let's stop paying them. Mockball them. And if they're going to stand anywhere, they should stand on the fort. Army career again, army tradition, which currently 27. Weishner's lose. Doesn't really make a difference. Uh, army professionalism is on three. Just go further, army tradition. Reform a Rajput kingdom gives an extra 0.5. I saw something in one of these as well. Gilly Army Tradition decays the first one. I'll rush put to Heartland. Kua is going to attack Makua. Alright, Moshasha is going to attack Hassa. What's going on here? Nagor versus Jaisoma. And Dunda. Alright, that's the Mawadi War. Soma is just with Dunda. Oh, there's so many ways we could expand if it wasn't for aggressive expansion. Access from Ukumayom. Senwe is bankrupt. Alright. <clears throat> Probably good to bring this guy home. Yeah, he's way over where he needs to be now. Tim Roots are bankrupt. And Nagor is dead. That was those guys in the middle. Or no, it was these guys here. Oh, I can't even remember. Alright, it was these guys here. 
big old dudda. Subtle Rajput smack demands. How dare they? Gain loyalty, gain influence, or lose stability. Alright, have some autonomy. Granted, generalship has expired, so. Yeah, that would put us over. Hmm. Well, actually. They are these guys. Mala, Bama. 9.6, 9.6, 5.7. Alright, let's have a look between these two. They're both fives. That's a three. Or, no. Let them keep the one with the fort on it. That's worth 2.5. That's worth three. This province is a better one to take away from the Rajputs. Drop the loyalty by 30. It's a little unfortunate. But worth it for a general. Yeah. Kick ass, dude. Gopal and Jared did. It's late at night. Is it 10.04? Yes, I do realise I'm mixing the 24-hour uh, time with the AMP. It's because it was the morning when I set that up. Alright, uh, tech. 10 years off here. We were going to... I guess decide firstly what the idea group's going to be. I'm thinking something diplomatic. We could do influence if we're going to be annexing people. And diplo rep and relations and everything. I mean, there's plenty of people around. You know what? Screw it. What's the other one you usually do? Diplomatic itself. It's good for the tech and the province war score costs. And for the finisher, influence. I think we're going to have to go influence first. So let's focus Diplo now. Malwa is going to attack Gwalior. Malwa is going to attack Gwalior. He's allied to Dunda and Junagar. Malwa is allied to Bengal. I mean, we do want to force them to drop, what was it, their cause and their cause. <clears throat> Can we even warn them? They are too rich and powerful. Alright, so who was he attacking? Gwalior, wasn't it? Could proclaim a guarantee on them instead. No, we'll just wait until later. National Epic for Prestige. Don't mind if we do. Try right, Timurids are bankrupt. Um, too many sea tiles away for us to be able to do anything. Could just do a declaration. Wouldn't be a horrible idea, but we shan't. Prestige training up is always nice. And uh, innovativeness is just sorting out the renaissance issue. Access from uh, Surumaru. No idea who that is. Access from uh, Gualia. Yes. We can make a state down here. Seems like a good enough idea. The other benefit of um, having them as vassals be a full core once we integrate them. God damn it. That is going to screw us over. Alright, well. This guy's deity shall be Ganesha as well. We need to improve relations. Yep, yeah, screw stability. So he was 42 or something when he died. God, that was horrible luck. <laughs> so I don't want to take that yet. <clears throat> they will 